Ole Miss is really motivated. Uh, they're all hungry. Um, we're looking forward to fighting for the top gun in the debate. And uh, they're proud to be last rather than you inside of the debate. We go through by the out there. Right now we're qualifying table six and all the crews are extremely proficient, extremely motivated and uh, ready to get this done. Always the big picture is modernization. Uh, it's definitely uh, given us a, an edge from the A3 when it comes to situational awareness. In terms of lethality, it gives those operators a more enhanced picture of the battlefield and it gives us increased sustainment uh, as far as operator level being able to identify uh, things that are going on with the vehicle in real time. When it comes to being the most modernized brigade in the Army, I'm actually pretty humbled to be out here. Uh, I actually started out with a SME on the follow-on test and evaluation of this vehicle. And coming to this brigade and being part of this modernization is actually a, a great thing for the Army. Inside of a Bradley crew, you have to be very tightly knit because if the driver's not able to hear the Bradley commander, then everything just falls apart. So it has to work really cohesively. So. We work on crew checks, fire commands, everything like that, up to just you know eating together and sleeping in the same brat together. You know, really building up that like brotherhood within the crews. Because you know, with new vehicles, you're not sure what to expect because there's definitely a lot of experienced personnel and a lot of new people coming up, learning about the Bradley A4s. There's been uh, plenty uh, challenges on the Bradleys, on and off. Field, but we fought through them, we've worked through them, we've learned how to work around them and make it work for us in the end.